Hey guys, Beach Hair Plumbing here, and today I'm here with my YouTube first Zern child toilet. So I don't believe this toilet actually has a name because when I look it up, it says child toilet. And the reason I say this is a YouTube first is because OCC Plumbing and Restorations on his channel three years ago uploaded a video, but it's just a still picture of this toilet. So he didn't like technically film the toilet itself and flush it or anything so this is basically the youtube first of it flushing and everything which is awesome so this toilet is commercial um it has a commercial style flush uh and the reason i say that is because the newer like the current generation american standard baby devoro toilets the tank and flushometer version are basically the exact same except one holds a flushometer and the other holds a tank but uh this toilet from the bottom of the base to the top of the rim is only 10 inches tall. And this thing is so light, I can literally throw it up in the air like 10 feet. So the trapway on it is actually very interesting. And this part of the trapway is actually very long. So, um, and the borance on this toilet is also really great as well. So uh, I don't have the pressure turned all the way up. It's just turned up maybe like two or two fifths of the way just to get it powerful enough to flush properly. but. Here is a flush on 1.6. Even though this is a 1.28 toilet, it still flushes just as fine on 1.6. So let me lock the focus and here's a flush. As y'all can see, even on uh, weaker pressure, the flush is actually very powerful. And again, the reason a flush is kind of long is because of the 1.6 diaphragm, even though this toilet is actually 1.28 gallons per flush. So, and I don't know, I'm sure I do somewhere uh, have a 1.28 gallon per flush diaphragm, but I'll probably just order a new one. So now I'll give you all another flush in this position or angle, whatever y'all want to call it. Here's another flush. This toilet also isn't very loud either, so I definitely don't think it'll scare little kids when they use it, but now I'm just gonna go ahead and turn up the pressure a little bit more and flush it and see how it does. And then after this flush, I'll go ahead and turn the pressure all the way up. Here is a flush. So again, just a little bit more powerful, but not insane. Now I'm gonna go ahead and turn it up all the way and this flush is actually extremely powerful and it doesn't really splash out too much which is honestly surprising to me but i'm gonna do kind of a close-up like this just so y'all can see the power of the bull rinse and everything so here is a flush on full pressure as y'all can see that is very powerful and i actually tried to like siphon this toilet out like I tried to plug the bottom, let it overflow and unplug it. And it literally will not siphon. You have to either directly pour water really fast into the trapway opening, or you have to plug it, let it start to flush and then let go of the outlet to let it siphon out. And maybe I'll do that in this video if I can, but um, here is another flush. Again, this toilet has an absolutely awesome flush. So I'm gonna do another flush from this angle so y'all can kind of see. And I apologize, there is a little bit of dirt on here. So, um, but again, this thing is brand new. I don't actually know the year of it. I couldn't find a date, but I also didn't look too hard. So I think it said 2013, but I don't know for sure. So it, this seems like it could be a lot newer than 2013, but here's another flush. <laughs> So other than way up at the top of the room there, this actually has a really good flush. And again, this had been sitting for a while and collected a lot of dust. But um, now I'm gonna see if I can go ahead and get it to siphon. This will be a little bit difficult and I'll actually have my friend hold the phone for me so I can uh, do this. So I'm gonna go ahead and lock the focus and you mind moving a little bit closer? Perfect, all right. Here is a flush attempting to get it to siphon. And it siphoned, so 
Obviously this toilet isn't really designed to siphon as it is commercial, but still the siphon is pretty interesting. So here's one more flush. And just for fun, let's flush a golf ball. Uh, obviously I'm sure it'll take it, but maybe not. It might get stuck in the trapway. We're about to find out. So once the water stops trickling, I'll go ahead and give it a flush. Here we go. Within like a split second, it flushed the golf ball. So yeah, really hope y'all enjoyed this video. If you did, please like, subscribe, leave all y'all's comments down below, and I will see y'all in my next video. Oh yeah, one last thing. There's this little sticker here. So, bye.